guys, thanks for joining me. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're returning to my channel, thank you so much for all of your continued love and support. And let's get right into the video. So today I um, am doing a, I guess, recreation of outfits that I seen on Pinterest. I was actually inspired by Jennifer over at um, uh, Mrs. Jennifer Brown. That's her channel name. I'll link her video down below. Uh, but she did a really cool video where she recreated um, outfits that she's seen on Pinterest. I thought that was really neat, so I wanted to try it myself. Uh, I'm not going out and shopping or buying new clothes right now with everything that's going on. Uh, so I just wanted to use um, items that I already had. So all of the outfits that I recreated, I, um, I tried to pick outfits that I knew I had those particular uh, pieces in my wardrobe. Uh, so let's get right into it with the first outfit. I chose to recreate um, this, I think it's a photo from like the Torrid website that I found on Pinterest. Um, I thought it was a really interesting way to, um, to pair like a denim shirt with kind of a more like summery skirt. Uh, unfortunately, I do have like a button-up denim shirt from Torrid. Um, it's kind of got like a little ombre effect going at the bottom, um, but I just tucked this into the skirt um, just so that way you couldn't see that part. I paired it with this skirt from, uh, well, I got it from Goodwill, uh, but it originally came from Target. I really like the way these two pieces worked together. Um, I think I'm gonna definitely wear this in the summertime. I really liked um, how comfortable the outfit was, but it still looked really put together. Uh, and I think I did a pretty good job of uh, recreating this first outfit. So this next outfit um, was a little bit tricky to put together. Um, but luckily I did, uh, I did have um, a yellow dress from Torrid that I got on Black Friday. So it was the buy, uh, buy one, get two free with the clearance. So I thought this dress matched pretty well, uh, with, you know, compared to the photo. Um, and then for the sweater part of the outfit, um, I actually bought this from Goodwill. I don't know what store it came from. I don't, I'm not familiar with the brand, uh, but it is in a 3X. Oh, and the dress was in a 3X as well. Part of this outfit that was a little bit different uh, than the photo was the boots. Uh, that's I didn't have any boots that were brown and that, that came up higher on my leg, except these ones that I had with the fur on the top. Uh, I think I got these at Target like years ago on clearance. Um, but I mean, for the sake of the photo, I think it looks pretty good. I don't know if I would wear that outfit all together, like out in public, um, but I think for the purpose of recreating the photo, it came out pretty close. So this next outfit um, is a little bit different um, from the photo. Um, so the girl in the, in the original photograph, she has like a long sleeve um, white and black striped shirt. Um, I didn't have anything like that in my closet, but I do um, have this like short sleeve uh, horizontal striped shirt uh, that I got from Torrid. Um, so I paired it with this um, skater skirt that I um, I think it's originally from Target, uh, but I got this at a like discount clothing store for like four bucks. This outfit was one of my absolute favorites that I recreated, and I think I'm actually gonna wear this again, uh, maybe during the summertime. The last outfit that I recreated um, had a lot of different components to it, um, starting with this little like sheer, I don't know, kimono, if that's what you would call it. Um, I couldn't find one uh, in my closet that was mostly like black, like the girl in the photograph, uh, but I have this one from uh, Forever 21. It had a lot of roses on it and I thought it was really pretty and it matched kind of the color of the blouse, uh, which is this shirt that I got from Charlotte Rouge. 
and I thought the color was pretty spot on. I know it wasn't the same style of shirt, but I figured it was close enough just based off of the color. Uh, and then the pants are just some, um, I think they're like these really thick leggings. I got them from Burlington Coat Factory. And then I just paired it with these heels that I got at Torrid. I think it was like a buy one, get two free. And I think I just grabbed these shoes because um, I didn't know what else to buy from the clearance area. Uh, but I actually really was surprised with how good this outfit turned out. And I think I will try pairing these items together again. I would have never thought to put them together, but I actually really liked the way it looked. Thank you guys so much for watching uh, this video if you made it to the end. Uh, today's video was a lot of fun to film, I think because uh, it kind of forced me to use a lot of the items in my closet that I don't normally wear. Um, I think when I'm shopping, I'll find something that I really like, and then when I bring it home, I'm kind of unsure of how to style it. Uh, so this challenge was really fun because uh, it really uh, made me kind of go outside of my comfort zone and put together outfits I wouldn't ever think to put together. Uh, so I definitely recommend trying it out. Uh, a big thanks again to Jennifer for posting her original video. Please go check it out. I'm going to link it down below. Um, and just be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!